Hi, I'm going to introduce the transmitter low voltage alarm and battery supply of RC6GSV3. Power on the transmitter. TX no power. There is warning of TX low power and the transmitter keeps beeping. It is caused by transmitter low voltage alarm. Please set the appropriate low voltage alarm in the transmitter. And the appropriate low voltage alarm depends on what battery it uses to power RC6GSV3. So what batteries can be used to power RC6GSV3? The working voltage of RC6GSV3 is 48 to 16.8 volts. And it is standard packed with a battery holder. The battery holder can hold 6 AE batteries. The voltage of a fully charged AE battery is 1.5 volts. So the total voltage of 6 fully charged AE batteries is 9 volts. And except AE battery, you can also use 2S, 3S, and 4S label battery to power the transmitter. And remove the AE batteries. And, and then pull the battery holder out. Two pins are inside it, and there are positive and negative signs next to the pins. And if the battery with JST connector to power RC6 GSV3. Make sure the collection is not reversed. A red cable is positive, black cable is negative. Here is a right collection. If the collection is reversed and the transmitter cannot be powered on, here is 2S sleeper battery. And how to set the transmitter low voltage alarm? Power on it. Don't press exit and enter button at the same time to enter the setting page. And let's go to number 19, alarm. TX means transmitter low voltage alarm and it defaults to 7.4 volts. We use 6 AE batteries to power the transmitter. And it is recommended to set 1.2 or 1.25 volts alarm for each battery. So you can set the alarm to 7.2 volts. And if you use sleep battery to power the transmitter, it is recommended to set 3.7 volts alarm for each cell. So you can set alarm to 7.4 volts for 2S battery. 11.1 volts for 3S and 14.8 volts for 4S battery. I use 2S LiPo battery, so I keep the alarm 7.4 volts. 7.4 volts here. And when the voltage of the battery is lower than the alarm value, the warning of TX low power will pop out and the transmitter will beep. And please note, Number one, all the battery can be used to power the transmitter, such as chargeable battery, battery pack, nickel metal hair dried battery, and so on. But please make sure the voltage is within the working range of RC6 GSV3, and the collector of the battery is JST. Here is JST connector. And number two, the USB port 
of RC6 GSB3 is not used to power the transmitter or battery. And it's only for firmware update. If you want to charge the LiPo battery, and you should use a professional LiPo battery charger, such as RadioLink CBA6 Plus charger. And you can check more details of the charger in the description of the video. And that's all about transmitter low voltage alarm and battery supply of RC6 GSV3. That's all. Thank you.